so let's say you have a company and someone saw something on your website or someone saw something on flyer or someone hears something from you or from other people so we have your website flyer brochure or whatever and referral this is the marketing that you do so some will be like okay hey i see one of those things but i have more questions they sent you an email and they want to ask you for more information about your product or services yeah so you need to send them more information how should the layout of your email should look like so that's what we're going to talk about uh, in this video so if you look at here we're going to start with a simple thing the subject you can just reply or thank you for your request for more information for example let's say someone created an, uh, you created a form on your website and someone requests more information so you can start by saying this i suppose it's 24 subject and then you can say thank you for your request for more information yeah so if they put it on a form you can start like this otherwise if someone sent you an email just reply on the email and that's uh, how you can start the email so we're going to start with the email with dear and then the person name make sure you have the name correct because this person can be a potential client so with every letter we will start with dear name not the name the name of the person of course and then we're going to start with i'm going to um let's start with the first one first and then i'm going to write it thank you for your request for more information on and then you can be like your company your company products or services okay that's the first sentence this is how you can start then i'm gonna write it down and then we're gonna talk about this This is an interesting one keep in mind that when you are doing this letter so you're adjusting this letter to your needs keep in mind that you need to um, do some things that make sense otherwise it's gonna be weird I will explain what I mean by that soon because if you're selling services you need to change it if you're not selling services you it changes the products makes sense right but some people don't understand that but uh, let's look at it so we started out by saying thank you for your request for more information some people will ask for more information but then they ask specifically a question some people they just send you a request for more information we just sent them this email right that's simple so um, you can tell something about your company company has been producing or providing services so producing products providing services since a year and we have a number of clients throughout the world you can make this standard we have an excellent reputation for quality liability and service and all our products are designed engineered and manufactured in the country if you're using products 
Otherwise, you need to change it. Keep in mind, it's important to know if you're providing service of products or both. Keep that in mind. Most of the time when you create products, you provide extra services so people um, can use those products. So you can also use both. I have enclosed a catalog to describe some products, so your price list. Please contact me for more sales information application assistance. I would like to be the further service service to you. Again, thank you for your interest in our company. So you put your company's name. So technically, you can create this template in order for you. When someone asks you for um, more information, you can just send them the templates and you can send them with a catalog of your price list so people know what your company is about and what you do sell. I have a dream. That's all I need. I'll make it happen with some work and belief. Know what I want, so I'll take it on. I've made mistakes, but mistakes make you strong. Let's break it down for a minute. I want the crown, I'm gon' get it. You hear me loud, man, I'm winning. Yeah, Charlie Sheen.